June the 26th, 2020. That's just a quick update. Uh, Comet Neowise is one of the groups of comets that we've been watching this summer. And it's now appearing on what's called Lasco C3. You can see it coming in right there. It's a lot larger than you see some of the sun divers on the satellite. But you're looking at an image that gives us an Earth-faced perspective of a satellite that's between us and the sun. The blue occulter disk in the center is um, it's like holding your hand up to the sun so you can see around it. In other words, it's blocking that glare. Now, this particular comet neowise as we go further into the summer it may become uh clear to the naked eye what's happening is it rises up through the ecliptic of our inner solar system the sun's glare in the daytime since we're going to be facing the sun of course in the daytime it's going to be very hard to see but as it rises up over the sun and moves back out it will uh is they're saying it may become naked eye visible and we've seen those before in the early morning or late evening when you can barely see one of these comets but it's brightening rapidly it's already past a magnitude three check this out now let's look at the jpl on it and this is again your jpl model which stands for jet propulsion laboratory out in pasadena california Right here you see 2020 F3 Neowise rising on the 29th, if you notice your bottom timestamp on the left. It's going to come through what we call the ecliptic, or the kind of the level edge of the inner solar system. As it comes up, it's going to come right through the orbit of Mercury, but more, Mercury's going to be uh, well behind that. You can see it on the left side of the sun now. And as it rises through this ecliptic on, in three days, it will become easier to see as it gets higher above that glare of the sun. It's interesting for you guys that like to watch this, especially with your telescopes and stuff. It should be very clear because they are saying now that it is rapidly brightening. It's going to be interesting, guys. We we watch a lot of things, but uh, comets are always have always been an interest of mine, and I usually show this information. We're watching a lot of things. But we're watching it, guys. You watch it. Uh, we're watching a lot of things right now. It's a heads up. Be safe.